Hello and a warm welcome to this beautifully compact arena in Rheinland-Pfalz, the Meva Arena. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray at the microphone and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It's Mainz facing RB Leipzig. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Now let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Kevin Kamper plays alongside Emil Forsberg in central midfield. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat. Lee Jae-sung. Will he play it in? Intercepting it intelligently. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Offside. Well, he doesn't need to make his movement quite so quickly there. Just let the ball be played into the space. Paulson. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Being pressed hard. Good visualisation and execution. And behind it's gone for a corner. And played short. Interception to snuff out the danger. Something to worry about here. Oh, great block. And they're going for the short one. Martin. Stach. Oh, this is looking promising. It's a perfect challenge. Paulsen. Leipzig moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And that puts them in position. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. They've given it away. Andre Silva. Campbell. Oh, surely! Determined defending. Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. Lee Jae Sung still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead but not forcing it able to skip past his man well he really read that brilliantly well that's how to do it inside your own penalty area Timo Werner. Good work to regain possession. Getting forward. But they dealt with the threat posed. Paulsen. Werner. Options in the middle. And the managers will now deliver their half to... Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Well, he could run onto it here. Well, nothing comes of it in the end, because the flag has gone up, Stuart. Well, he knew where the space was but he's just been too eager, and that's why he's offside. Anton Stach. 
the supporters want to see him have a go. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Now possibilities in the centre. Magnificent defending. Paulsen. Well, he's lost the ball. Lee J. Sung. And what can they do to stop him running at them? But really sticking to their task defensively. And does well to keep it in play. Paulsen. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Andre Silva. Still looking for space. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Very quick thinking there. And space here on the flank. Can he open the door to a potential goal? So deflection, and they can get ready for the corner kick routine. Elects to go short. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Kevin Kumpel. And given away. It might be on for them. Oh, a vital interception. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? Kevin Kumpel. An important interception. Good movement. Crossing possibilities. This could finish it. Splendid defending. Powerson. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? All hands on deck. Well, that is how to break up a counter-attack. And just five minutes remaining. And Kunku? Well, a wasted opportunity. It would have been a decent chance, but offside the decision. Anton Stach. In with a chance. Oh, it's in. And that might be the goal that clinches it for them. No looking back now, surely. So that will be all for this game and a bad day.
got a few more days to slay It's gonna get so much louder Now we're here to take control Over your body and over your soul We're gonna take back everything and lose it all Lose it all, lose it all Feel it in your arms, feel it in your legs Feel it on your fingertips and feel it Hello to you from the Rhinelands. We find ourselves tonight here in Western Germany in the city of Leverkusen. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson and looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga. It's Bayer Leverkusen up against Hertha Berlin. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Can he put it away? And a goal! Just what the fans wanted to see. The ideal way to begin. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Oh, a nice-looking pass. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. And another one! Two great goals! Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? So, the ball rolling again at 2-0. Closed down straight away. Played over. Well, still an issue here. Well, really rifling that one in, and he didn't miss by much. Wirtz. Schick. That's a well-struck pass. Oh, good work by the keeper. He really read that brilliantly. But he 
was in the right place to intercept. It'll be a corner. Over it comes. Another goal! And surely there's no way they can throw this away. Absolutely dominant. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Fine cross into the middle. Oh, my God. And touched onto the frame of the goal. Speculative effort. Oh, a superb save. Osmoon. Well, as those stats tell us, Leverkusen have enjoyed more of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Jean-Paul Boetius. Wasteful from Hertha. This is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Read it superbly to take back possession. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Succeeded in keeping it in play. They've regained possession. And given away by Leverkusen. So, half time. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. And that is how to beat your opponent. And Patrick Schick now. Great opportunity. That is how to put in a challenge. He's been a bit unlucky to concede the corner. As they restart the game, it's fair to say the gulf in quality between the two sides has been huge. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. And Patrick Schick now. Can they convert? It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, it's an out-and-out out pasting. 6-0. Cheek. Oh, breezing past him. Can he put it away? And still danger here. Thirty minutes to go then. Really good block. And taking it away. Liebe Fans, wussten Sie schon, dass Sie bei unserem nächsten deutschen Reisemittel abstimmen können? Entscheiden Sie jetzt mit alle Infos im Internet. Shot attempted. Putting his body on the line. Might be onto something. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Cleared away comprehensively. 
cheek. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And Leverkusen regaining possession. A quarter of an hour remaining here. And he stopped them in their tracks. It's UK. Moussa Diaby. And the cross smuggled away. Well, you've got to savour such moments. Terrific block. In position. Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. Kevin Prince Boateng. It is a decent looking attack here. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. A really top notch piece of defending. Diaby. Just the challenge that was required. Able to skip past his man. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. And that will be all for this game anyway. And defeat for the visitors. Much to the... Came into my life just like another season. Not for long, just a time, just like another season. Maybe this time next year you'll reappear for no reason. But I'll cherish every day until you come my way this season.
Union Berlin facing Bayer Leverkusen. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Schaefer. No danger here as he runs at them. It's got to be! And that goes down as a very disappointing attempt. Well, the keeper can't believe his luck. That's a really poor effort. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stewart, in particular, what do you expect to see from him? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. And steered back under a bit of pressure. Now can they make something happen? Well, possibilities inside the box. Well, they've given him too much space. The save was a good one. Knocker. Gieselmann. Labeling. Sven Michel. Beautifully weighted ball. Well, even marginally offside is still against the law. Yeah, and he just needed to hold his run for a fraction longer and he would have been in on goal. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. See Batcher. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Cheek. And they did have the ball, but not anymore. Kevin Behrens. Superb save. Palacios. Good movement. Chic. Superbly read and executed. Behrens. On the ball, see Batcher. Will he play it in? In position, but pressure to cope with. Osmoon. And space here on the flank. Now veering in field. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Sven Michel. And showing fine vision. Well, not to be. He had moved into an illegal position. Well, it's great that he wants to run in behind, but he has to get the timing right. Diaby. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. See Batcher. And in possession, Trimmel. Haberer. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. And a throw in for Union. And with that, the first half comes to an end. So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. Well, nicely cut out. How can he take them on and beat them? Options in the centre. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together.
Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. In it goes, the opening goal in this contest. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Adli. Schick. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Well, attacking possibilities, but quick thinking defensively. Intelligent threaded pass here. Opportunity, and still a chance. Well, he made great contact with that one but the goalkeeper had his own ideas. So, a corner here. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Can he finish this? And it's gone in, just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. And it's still on for him. Oh, great defending. Into the final 20 minutes. Florian Wirtz. In behind for him to chase. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Oh, in it goes! Sensational strike! And now he deserves to celebrate! And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Sheik. Oh, in with a chance! And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. They take it short. Diaby. It's got to be! But if truth be told, he made it rather straightforward for the keeper. Well, he knows it. That is a real waste of a great opportunity. Christopher Trimmel. On the ball, Sebatcher. Now can they make something happen? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Good-looking ball. There could be a chance now. He's in behind. How about this for drama? All even once more. Astonishing. Not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team. Schaefer, Sven Michel, trying to get onto the front foot with the minutes ticking away. Oh, how on earth has he missed that? What a glorious opportunity. Well, the flag's gone up and he was offside, but he didn't know that when he took his shot. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And there's the whistle, they cannot be separated.
Hello and welcome to the Hanseatic city of Bremen. We're here at the Von Invest Weserstadion. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It's Werder Bremen facing Bayer Leverkusen. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. In position, and the keeper more than equal to the task. Who can they pick out? And he's in. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Adam Klojek. Schick. Klojek. Skipping away. Not quite the cross he was hoping for. Not the pass he had in mind. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. 1-0 then. Surely. Marvin Dux. Possession lost, intercepted. Well, a good tackle. Christian Gross. Pieper. Well, the pass not finding its target. A oh, terrific pass. And will it be the leveller? Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Can he find the right pass? It might be. And it's in. All square again. What a match this is turning out to be. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. At times they make passing look easy. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Big chance. The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing, and now they sense victory. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Could be threatening. And out of play for a Leverkusen throw-in. Really a very poor ball. Nice looking pass. Bailey Sink Grafen. Schick. Body on the line. And the first half story has been written. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Super tackle and they've won possession.
This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. Marvin Dux. I must say, this looks promising. It's there for him. Terrific piece of anticipation. Able to clear the danger. Corner kick, though, here. Amos Pipa. Jung. It's there for him. And how about that for a save? And they're going for the short one. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. Short corner taken. An attack full of promise. No problems grabbing hold of that one. Adam Hlozek. Excellent ball over the top. Looking for the angle. It's a corner. And over it comes. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Well, they were so close to the equaliser there. They're certainly a bit unlucky, but they need to make more of these chances. Well, they have to have that sense of self-belief. It could happen for them. Schick. Players waiting in the centre, showing patience, looking for the equaliser. And a goal to level this contest, all even. So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. Teammates in the middle. And that goes down as a very disappointing attempt. Well, the keeper can't believe his luck. That's a really poor effort. Well, those stats tell you what a good game this has been. We've seen a lot of good attack in play. Plenty of oh, goals. Oh, Stuart, they could be in here. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Beautiful pass. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Well, still time for them to level it. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Opportunity it is. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Oh, lovely ball. It just needs to remain icy cool. Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. Frimpong. Diaby. They've given it away. Making sure it didn't get past him. And we will have just one additional minute. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way.
down to you from the Rhinelands. We find ourselves tonight here in Western Germany in the city of Leverkusen. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner as always is Stuart Robson and looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga. It's Bayer Leverkusen up against Bayern Munich. Yes, thanks as always Derek. We've got two good teams here so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Showing a real will to win the ball. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. And so they start at 11 for Bayern. Sven Ulreich begins between the posts. Matthijs de Ligt plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. Sadio Mane starts with Leroy Zane in the wide areas. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Can he convert? And a goal! Just what the fans wanted to see. The ideal way to begin. 1-0 then. Bad pass. Leon Goretzka. Zane has it. And the attack looks promising. And he takes it on. Body in the way. Corner kick awarded. And let's see if this will help them add to the lead. bad challenge and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next clears it away well a corner here and that might boost their hopes the high press was on and the chance is on well goal kick just as it was looking promising Goretzka Leon Goretzka Choupo-Moting has it getting forward but really sticking to the task defensively that's a lovely ball no possibilities in the centre and the cross didn't beat the first man Promoting. and Bayern the recipients of the free kick here and players waiting at the far post well it came to nothing in the end oh nice ball over the top to chase Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Well, as you can hear, the fans think that should have been a penalty, but I'm not convinced. An unforced error, you've got to say. Can he find the net? Now, keeper getting both gloves on the ball.
Mane, it's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. And no. So the second half is underway, and I must say it was sparkling stuff from Bayern in the first 45. Viet. And space to cross it. An alert piece of defending. Oh, great vision. Well, wasted opportunity here. Would have been a decent chance, but offside the verdict. Teammates available, but nothing comes of it. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Can they keep it going? And the ball is loose. Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. Well, Bayern have been really incisive today. Their movement, their passing and their end product has been too much for their opponents here. Well, it would have been a chance, but the run was mistimed. Offside. Very quick thinking there. Oh, great vision. Oh, could be. And there is the goal. Well, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. We're back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. High quality defending. Useful looking ball. An absolutely breathtaking smell. We were ready to write them off, but not anymore. All square now. Well, it has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. De Ligt. Leon Goretzka. Zane has it. Untidy in possession. Well, time's running out, but these fans are driving their team on here. He must finish! from the keeper fantastic stop Super Moting oh good looking run but stout defending when it mattered good looking ball there could be a chance now well, nothing comes of it in the end because the flag has gone up, Stuart. Well, he knew where the space was, but he's just been too eager, and that's why he's offside. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Can they take the lead here? And a goal it is to put them in front again! No less than they deserve! What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Chance to cross. And Patrick Schick now. He's got to have a go here. Well, it turns out to be fairly routine for the keeper in the end. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement in this match. Plenty of support here. He's going forward well here. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were...
This should be very enjoyable. It's Bayern who get things going. Here's the initial 11 for Bayern. Sven Ulreich starts in goal. Matthijs de Ligt plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. Sadio Mane starts with Leroy Zane in the wide positions. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Oh, he saved it well. Behrens. No space for them here. It has to be. And a goal. Not bad for starters. They take an early lead. Well, as Bayern get the ball moving again, how will they react? Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? Really important tackle. Schaefer. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Well, the attack looks promising. Tremendously strong in the tackle. And a good take under duress there. Now, who can he play it to? Oh, surely. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Goretzka. Sané. And far from the ideal cross. Keeper's ball all the way. Choupo-Moting. Well, they get themselves level here. Oh, good save. So the corner played into the box. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. See Batchu. Kevin Behrens. Options in the middle. He might be able to carve something out. Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Schaefer. Teammates available. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Moving into the advanced position. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Well, approaching half-time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Well, from an attacking point of view, it's been a very good performance. I've really liked the way they've got the ball from back to front, then how the forwards have got away from their markers, and the speed of their attacks as well. It's been a really impressive first half. Is it going to be? This is astonishing stuff. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. And the cross goes in. In position. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Mane. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Goretzka and with that the referee blows the whistle so the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway this might have potential well, didn't go to plan in the end
Sané. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Schaefer. See Batchu. Well, can they be creative from here? Still looking to get the shot off. Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? Really bright-looking attack. Can he do it? Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. A lopsided contest. 4-0. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. And a goal it is. But offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he was just offside. Great decision by the assistant. Behrens. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had most of the ball and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. What can they do to stop him running at them? Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. But it didn't end up being a significant advantage, and so a free kick here. He's got to have a go here. Nothing wrong with the idea on the free kick, but the goalkeeper has it. Playing it short. And the ball's gone. Skipping away. Making progress. It might be. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Big chance it is. A deft clearance. Sloppy from Sané. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. And what a magical save it was! They take it short. Really good interception. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Now, well, that's a well-timed pass. No let-up in the pressing department. Schaefer. Becker. Determined defending. Five minutes left. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have realised that was going to be offside. That's a poor decision to play that pass. Schaefer. Nicely timed tackle. Mane. Choupo-Moting. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. And there goes the final whistle, and the home fans are... Well, space.
feel like I linger Linger between the words to say eh? To say the words you remember Now we're here to take control Over your body and over your soul We're gonna take back everything and lose it all Lose it all The focus is on live action from Liga. It is Rennes and they face Racing Club de Lens. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Can he make it count? Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. Playing it in. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent. So what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute. Keeper getting the touch. Well, they can bring it out now. Committed challenge. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Jeremy Doku. Now they stopped them in their tracks. He's got the right idea with that pass. Well, decent save there. Corner kick played in. And it goes! Two goals in rapid fire fashion and looking very comfortable here. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Well, possibilities in the centre. The outcome is a goal kick here. Jimmy Cabell. And threading it forward. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Effective challenge. Jimmy Cabell. Can he finish? And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Benjamin Bourigeau. Well, Derek, this has been a really good performance, as you can see. They've created numerous chances. They're winning the game comfortably. And they oh, hang on, Stuart. Look at this. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And tremendous individual skill. Lovely ball over the top. He had to score, and he does. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. That'll be a Wren throw in. Lovro Meyer. And it might be. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Who can he pick out? Free kick awarded then by the referee. Determined defending. And the pass could do damage. And a 
goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Corner awarded. Now sending it in. A chance then. For... Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. Getting in there to intercept. Openda. Wesley Said. Oh, a lovely ball. Well, it was easy on the eye, but the interception was made. It's a perfect challenge and a good take under duress there. Machado. Individual brilliance. Can he take advantage? Oh, did so well to deny him. Going short. And he cuts in from the wing. Really nice ball. And he's made headway. Oh dear. A moment to forget all about, I think. Well, he has to do a lot better there. He's gone for power, but he's completely miscued it. Tight. Really good interception. A good and fair challenge. Tight. Lovro Meyer. Guiri in possession. Can they convert? Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. Lovro Maia. Well, not quite the result he was hoping for with that shot. Close, though. Couldn't hang on to it. Openda. Laid into the box. Well, he'll be a bit deflated following that effort, but he was being tightly marked. Just ten minutes remaining here. Cali Muendo. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. So the final whistle almost upon us and this is not exactly what the home fans had in mind when they arrived at the ground today, Stuart. Well, they just never got going. People will point fingers towards the centre-backs and keeper and to be fair, they've been poor, no doubt about that. But they haven't had much protection. There's been so much space for their opponents to operate in and they've had a field day. The final whistle can't come soon enough. He's in behind. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Could cross it in here. Oh, fancy footwork. Must score! And still danger here. And a goal to settle the issue. 
issue once and for all. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far. of you Like a wave returns to the sea into the blue They change but in a cycle that I can't lose Each painful but delightful to live through You came into my life just like another season not for long, just a time Just like another season Maybe this time next year You'll repeat for no reason But I'll cherish every day Until you come my way this season Delighted to be talking to you from one of my favourite venues in world football, the Orange Vélodrome. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And the focus is on live action. Could be! Just couldn't get it through.
Genghis Under. Out of play, Marseille throw in. Could play it in. Gentusi. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Rogier. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. And taken short. Gentusi. On to Indev. Superb block. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. Terrier. Oh, great defending. Malinowski. Lovro Meyer. In possession, Flavio Tai. Can he put it away? Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Jing. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Rogier. Opportunity. And a goal! through 1-0 here and the ball moving again what sort of response will we see from them now Lovro Maia and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end in behind for him to chase is moving again 2-0 is how it stands and a good looking ball well nothing comes of it in the end because the flag has gone up Stuart well he knew where the space was but he's just been too eager and that's why he's offside well as the stats confirm Marseille have controlled the ball and as a result have dominated the game some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that well first they have a bit of defending to do Terrier and it's gone behind for the corner. And there's the delivery. It might still be problematic. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Malinowski. Useful looking ball. Real chance. And a goal to increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? So the action continues, and Marseille very much bossing the proceedings. Terrier. Can he finish here? And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. So back underway at 3 1. Oh, that's a well timed pass. Crossing possibilities. And a goal! They just keep believing. Who's to say they can't do it now? On with the game then. 3-2. What will happen? Well, underway once more. And it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Well, far from the ideal pass. Now, can they create something? Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Valentin Rogier. Matteo Guendouzi. Is this the moment? The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. 
You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, it's been an incredible performance from him. Clearly the difference between the two sides. Obviously the goals, but his movement too. He's causing the back line all sorts of headaches. He'll no doubt be desperate to grab the hat-trick now. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And into the last 30 minutes now. Just the challenge that was required. Now options are plenty. Rogier. No way through. It's got to be. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Bamba Dieng. Promising sequence. Great opportunity. And saved by the keeper. Terrier. He's got to have a go here. Well, fantastic reflex action. Who's going to get on the end of it? Superb block. And a goal it is. But offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he was just offside. Great decision by the assistant. Guendouzi. And Rogier. He read the situation defensively and did his job. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Tight. And the referee blows for a foul. And a timely intervention. Teammates available. Not a good pass. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Kali Muendo. And that is the end of the contest and not a happy outcome as far as...
different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Arno Kalimuendo. There it is! A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Underway once more. And it's going to be interesting to see whether or not PSG can articulate an appropriate reply. Mbappe, he's in behind. Oh, and a wonderful stop. But the offside flag has gone up and it grinds to a halt. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Danilo Pereira. A very effective challenge put in. And a tidy ball. Crossing opportunity. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. A really vital interception. Mbappe. Ekitike. Here's Mbappe. And a poor ball. Now PSG moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Cali Muendo. Chers amis, soyons attentifs ensemble. Merci de signaler à l'un de nos autres le moindre comportement ou colis suspect. Mbappé. Neymar! Well, flinging himself up the ball. Well, opting for the short corner. Danilo Pereira. An alert piece of defending. Danilo Pereira could pull one back here. And he does! He's thrown his team a lifeline. The belief is back. And away they go once more, and plenty still for Paris Saint. And there is the goal to make it a hat-trick! Excellence in finishing, there for all to see! So back underway, 3-1 the score. Amin Gouiri. Well, with the half-time interval fast approaching, PSG can't be happy with this state of affairs. What to do for them, Stuart? Well, they've been outplayed in this first half, and they need that half-time whistle to come soon so they can regroup, change one or two things tactically, and come out with a better... Oh, Stuart, an opportunity! Not out of the woods yet! Well, they survived the attack. That's a very fine piece of tackling. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Now, brilliant work to keep that one in play. Benjamin Bourigeau. Determined defending. And that is that for the first half. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Traore on attacking possibilities, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Nuno Mensch. Messi. 
Mbappe moving the ball effectively Fabian and a goal not over just yet and the ball is moving again 3-2 Fabian giving it a try tremendous block oh splendid skill As you can see, the visitors have had much less of the ball, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Well, that's right, preserving the lead and doing it really well. High quality defending. Doku. And he's broken free. Oh, it looked as though he might be through. Not so. Danilo Pereira. In behind for him to chase. And he clears it out of harm's way. It did look on for them, but not to be. Now oh, showing excellent vision. This could square the game, and that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them. Underway again. We can't complain about a lack of entertainment. 3-3. Three, three. Well, just as well from the defensive point of view that he was able to make that interception. And into the last 20 minutes. Minch. Well, they keep the ball moving. Really a very poor ball. Cali Muendo. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Oh, could be. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Neymar Hugo Ekitike attacking possibilities for PSG he'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge and given away Mbappe a good and fair challenge well the counter chance looks very real well it petered out well, this game is ebbing away and the situation currently not favourable for PSG, Stuart. Well, surely they get one more chance before the end here. Forget the defending, they're playing some great attacking football and I think they deserve an equaliser. Oh, look at this, Stuart, an opportunity. Oh, a goal! That levels it in the closing phase of this game. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Traore, Arno Calimuendo. And given the situation, a goal at this stage might well turn out to be a winner. A sloppy pass. Amin Guiri. Here's Mbappe. Might it be Mbappe? Full credit, wonderful stop. There we have it, the 90 minutes are over.
Mato Siwa. Options in the middle. Superb block. It could be up for grabs. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Well, what a chance that was to take the lead. But you have to give the goalkeeper credit. What a brilliant save that was. And a good looking ball. And they could do damage. Oh, good work by the keeper. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man. Oh, look out, Derek, chance here. Oh, right in the nick of time. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Now, options are plenty. 
but the danger averted for now. Azor Matusiwa using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. And a threatening looking ball. It could be. Can he find the angle? Wonderful chance. And it's in. 1 0. They breached the defence. So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Not a good pass. A chance to whip it in. That is how to put in a challenge. He's been a bit unlucky to concede the corner. Well, not the best clearance. Bouhijo. And he stopped them in their tracks. Mbuku. Well, offside here. Such a pity for them. Chance was on. Amin Guiri. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Could be. And a goal to level this contest, all even. So back underway following the equaliser. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Not to be this time. Balogun. And with that, the first half draws to it. So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. Now what can they do from here? Real chance. Well, he was on his own but couldn't take advantage of it. Well, I'm not surprised he missed that. He never really looked in complete control, did he? Marshal Munetzi. Now well, there to intercept. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have realised that was going to be offside. That's a poor decision to play that pass. Marshal Munetzi. Aber Zanelli. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Can they forge ahead? Foiling his opponent completely. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he plugged away in that first half, making run after run without too much success, but eventually he got his reward, and what an important goal it was. Now the keeper performing brilliantly. Well, that's just incredible. He reacted so quickly there. Well, a chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. That is how to apply the pressure. 
Oh, nice work to get past his opponents. Well, possibilities in the centre. Shot attempted. Terrific block. Will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead? And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Unable to keep the ball that time. On the offensive. But he could run onto it here. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Oh, what an opportunity. Is it going to be? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Pressing as a team. An alert piece of defending. Kali Muendo. Jeremy Doku. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Azor Matusiwa. Busi. Teammates available. They're showing a willingness to attack as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. Kali Muendo. Could cross it in here. Tanael Mbuku and given away this could finish it and in all likelihood that is game over so little time left for a response so they get the ball moving again 3-1 the scoreline here what's going to happen next and that is going to be that well a tale of woe and turmoil
to have you with us. Our travels have taken us to the south of France. We're at the Orange Vélodrome. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from Ligue 1. It's Marseille, and they take on Stade de Reims. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Monetzi. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. He'll have a go here. Keeper getting the touch. Well, they can bring it out now. An alert intervention. It's got to be. He's blocked it. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Delightful pass. He might profit from here, you know. Surely. Defending of the highest class to stop him. Mbuku. Running room in the wide position. But a good piece of defence. They were playing fluent football, but then the foul. And now you would anticipate a yellow card. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Genghis Under. Well, no stopping him. Rogier. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. 1-0 then. And still looking for space. Oh, big chance. It's still alive. And the decision offside here. And that'll be a Marseille throw in. Valentin Rogier. Can he finish? And throwing himself up the ball. And a short corner, let's see. Alexis Sanchez. Now just the tackle that was needed. Really good attacking play. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. So nearing the break, and Marseille hold the edge here. Stuart, how about your overall take? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Perfect tackle. Valentin Rogier. Renduzzi. And so there it is, the first. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Mbuku. Will it be? Oh, great block. And good pressure high up the pitch. 
No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Can he finish this? And nicely parried away. Well, do you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score, Derek? They've been piling on the pressure now and really should be ahead in this one. They might be able to get in now. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Nuno Tavares. Now it's Alexis Sanchez. Could play it in. Will this corner bear fruit for them? Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. And it's in! They're back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, 2-1 it is here. A move of promise on the flank. Now a decent position. Can he get them level? Oh, there it is! A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted nearly minutes. So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. Munetzi. Promising looking attack from Marseille. Sanchez chance to put them in front Gendouzi now with Rogier wonderful chance and a goal to seal the hat-trick a masterclass in finishing just can't stop him today well a dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider Disappointing pass. Malinowski. Chance to do damage. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. On to Malinowski. And attempting the through ball. Can he put it away? Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue Be This could finish it! And a really good diving stop. They favoured a short one here. Rogier. On to Inder. Can they hit on the break? Well, time is against them. They have work to do. Spot on with that tackle. And not a great challenge. Free kick here. Can he find the right pass? And close, but offside nonetheless. Now well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. Balogun. And now it is final. This match is officially over and it goes into the books as a win.
from Liga, technically speaking, one of the finest leagues in the world. It is Nice, and they take on Lille. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Getting forward. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Now, potential danger. Well, following the clearance, it will be a corner. And he clears the danger. Bamba. There it is. A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. And back underway. 1-0 it is. comes to nothing in the end really should have made more of that Remy Cabela well they have it again well that's one for them to pursue well the flag was up in good time bringing that move to an end well he's just got to be more patient there he's gone too early Cabela well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And space to exploit, maybe. Must be! And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. So the corner played into the box. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Bamba Cabela moving the ball forward with purpose but timely defending when it mattered Bamba well read to win possession back Plattered away David and support available Unas it's there for him oh narrowly wide so unlucky so out of play and a throw in here for Lille 
Not the pass he had in mind. Pepe. Firing it in. Oh, really close. Just over the top. And he saw the situation developing. And do they mean business on this occasion? A fine reading of the situation. Beautifully weighted ball, but not quite what was needed. I really thought they were going to open up the defence. Good Munson. Well read to ease the pressure. Crossing opportunity. Pepe. Well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, it petered out. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. And the whistle is... And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Remy Cabela. Difficult to stop him. Gives it a go. And he read it really well. Fine save. He's driven in the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. Defensive excellence there. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, a badly timed run. Just a fraction offside. Bayo. Can he take the chance? Well, really, making the goalkeeper's life simple. That should be hit in the back of the net. That was a big, big chance. Well, as the stats tell us, they just haven't created enough chances. They need to get the ball into wide areas, get crosses into the box, and then get their front players. And a goal to delight the fans! Just what they were hoping for! So there we have it, 2-1. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. So a half an hour remaining. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, it wasn't all that far off the target. Well, you're absolutely right. That was close, but the game is still very much in the balance here. And good pressure high up the pitch. Bayo. Andre. It's there for him. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Nicola Pepe. Pepe. Oh, good technique in terms of how he struck it. Jonathan David. Just the challenge that was required. Oh, great vision. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Takes on the shots. a tale of four goals in this match now 3-1 it is and he takes it on how much run of the mill as saves go 
Bayo. Just not looking confident in possession. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Firing it towards goal. Body in the way. A real struggle to contain him. André. Not a bad pass it was. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Can they take advantage? Just needs to stay calm. Oh, how about that for a chip? Savour it. Pure brilliance. And we're underway again. This game very much over as a contest. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Can he convert? And that will be all for this game anyway, and defeat for the visitors.
on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And all set to bring you live action from Liga Uber Eats coming right up. It's Toulouse up against Nice. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And a chance to whip it in here. Excellent defending. Andy Delors. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Well, not allowed to continue. He had drifted into the offside position. Well, if he takes a step back to the ball and then spins in behind, he'll be onside. But he does know where the space is. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique and awareness. He will certainly need to be tightly marked today. And he was in the right place to intercept. Ado Onaiwu. And attempting the through ball. Will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead? And there it is! The breakthrough! That will do nicely! So underway again here. 1-0 the score. Branko van den Bowman went in strongly, decisively. Good effort here! And the keeper getting across to stop it. Let's see about the delivery. Superb block. Todibo. Kefren to Ram. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Can he find the net? On Iwu. Beautifully disguised ball. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. And beating the defender. Could be! And it's in! All square again! What a match this is turning out to be! So back underway following the equaliser. Branko van den Bowman. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Nicola Pepe. Bar. Could take the lead. And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Can he deliver it with accuracy? On I will. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. And so it is, the first half score. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. 
Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Can they trouble the opposition this time? An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Going short. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. He read the situation defensively and did his job. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half, but he'll be looking to build on his goal in the second 45. Well, harried into losing the ball. Really effective pressing. Well, sloppy in possession. Able to skip past his man. Happy to take on the shot. Oh, a smart stop. Corner kick played in. Oh, he's lost possession. Well, the stats tell you everything. They've created opportunities, they've created chances, but they just haven't taken any. It's been a really poor display in front of goal. They've got to do a lot better with their finishing. an interesting pass and a goal to re-establish their advantage just look at the celebrations so back underway at 2-1 tight contest here strong but fair tackle <laughs> To the final 20 minutes had to come up with the ball and did Todibo Lotomba and Ramsey this could level it well that takes the wind out of their sails great defending Well, let's see if something comes of this. Well, decent save there. Over it comes. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. Well, this might be their final opportunity to draw level. The clearance wasn't decisive. Well, pressure building, another corner. Really vital interception here. A real opening now. Oh, right in the nick of time. Now, options are plenty. Now, just the tackle that was needed. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. Silla. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent their last chance to grab an equaliser. And clearing is away. And that will be all for this game anyway, and defeat for the visitors.
Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And a lot to be excited about because coming up for you, action from Liga. It's Monaco up against Nice. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. A wonderful intervention. Oh, he's lost possession. Braille Embolo. And teammates around him. Embolo. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Jordan Lotomba. Oh, splendid skill. Laborde. Well read to put an end to that attack. Yusuf Fofana. And a tidy tackle. Could be! And diving to thwart him. And he's fired over the corner. An alert reaction to tip it over. Behind for another corner. Can they cash in? A goal! They've opened the scoring in the derby. And I'll tell you what, you can hear a pin drop in here. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Takes aim! High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Diata. Embolo. On to Forland. Very quick thinking there. Ramsey. Kevin Follant. Given away by Monaco. Well, that is how to play advantage. Labon. Good vision. Can he get onto this? But mistimed his run. Well, he's got the timing all wrong there. He just needs to bide his time. Went in strongly, decisively. Labon. Can he take the chance? Oh, the post denied him. And I think the threat has been averted. Well, had that gone in, the game was firmly in their hands. Now, though, they've got to make sure they don't let this slip. Yes, so near indeed, but now they've got to concentrate on keeping their defensive shape. And a good-looking ball. Now shot happy here. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. And over it comes. Something to worry about here. And no way through. And the upshot of that is offside. Well, he needed to look elsewhere because the flag was always going to go up. He's given it away. And now passing it through. Oh, a smart stop. Now the electronic board showing one additional minute. And with that, the first half draws to him. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Kevin Follant. Teammates available. Well, disappointing end to the move.
La Bon. Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. Not the best clearance. Pepe. And an astute piece of defending. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. But then the one that fails to hit its target. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, I really liked his first half display. He was certainly the most influential player on the field. And I'm expecting more of oh, the same. Oh, wait a minute. They could well be in. Well, I must say, that goes down as a very disappointing effort. We're into the final half hour. Braille Embolo. And he read it well. This looks threatening. Can they stop it going in? Well, nothing comes of it. And now it's with Embolo. Diata. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Volant. Shot attempted. And using his body to good effect. Could be a chance to break here. Can they keep it going? Magnificent challenge to win it back. Well, Monaco are enjoying most of the possession here, but they've shown a real lack of invention today. One or two of their more talented players need to step up now to get them back into this game. Fifteen minutes left for play. Well, the timing was perfect. Ball one. Bar. Diata. I don't see what attacking position. It's not too late for them. Golovin. And they find a gap in the defence. Well, tremendous block. Nicola Pepe. Well, on the cusp of full time, the home side keep plugging away, but find them... It's got to be! Well, that surely would have put this game to bed. Well, definitely, that would have won the game for them. That's a bad miss. So, making the substitution now. <laughs> Mohamed Kamara. In possession, Follant. And he read it well, intercepting it. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. And still an opportunity. Oh, it's a goal! A late leveller! Derby drama to square the game! And an atmosphere to match the moment! So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Well, the referee blows the whistle. Nothing...
Floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And what we're getting ready to bring you is live action from Liga. It is Nice. Can he do it? He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! So, underway again here. one nil the score. Well, that's a super ball over the top. Well, not to be. He had moved into an illegal position. Well, it's great that he wants to run in behind, but he has to get the timing right. And taking it away. A real struggle to contain him. Could play it in. Has a go. And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? So the ball rolling again at 2 0. Ramsey. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Steffi Mabadidi. They've given it away. Isham Boudawi. Now this could be productive. And he takes it on. And he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today. Can he finish? And a crisp effort just over the top. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And they will be awarded a free kick for that. Oh, he's really opened them up here. He's in position. A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Three goals without reply. Take it away. Wabi Hazri. Oh, skipping away. The referee spotted the infringement and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. Ramsey. Onto Delor. Pepe. It's still alive. But well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. And still an opportunity. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Leo Leroy. And Nice come away with it. Well, not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. And threading it forward. Excellent block. Who can they pick out? And a headed goal! Right on cue. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Poor pass under no real pressure. Oh. 
Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Firing it towards goal. And using his body to good effect. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Might be a chance here. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. And so the second half commences here. And it was one-way traffic in the first half. They're going to need all their time if they have designs on a comeback. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. And a goal to seal the hat-trick! A masterclass in finishing! Just can't stop him today! A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. And Ramsey... Getting forward. And let's give credit to the defending. Well, a joy to watch. Ramsey. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. And it's gone behind for the corner. Can they convert? And still a chance. Oh, that is extraordinary! True athleticism to make contact in that fashion, and it's one of the finest goals you're ever likely to see. Simply stunning. And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Isham Budawi. Turam. Ramsey has it. Ball's gone. Beautifully disguised ball. But ably intercepted when it looked as though they might be in. And it's a quality pass. This had to look a bit lively given the pressure. Jordan Ferry. Excellent vision. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had most of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Slipshod passing. Just 15 minutes remaining. A oh, terrific pass. Just couldn't capitalise there. Intense pressure. Arnaud Nordin. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Isham Budawi. Ramsey! Oh, good reflexes from the keeper, and the danger averted. Under pressure to get it away. Textbook defending inside the box. And the counter looks on here. Options available. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. And crossed in there. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be...
store for you today the hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium the tension palpable stay tuned we'll have all the action for you live here on ea tv leo leroy and ferries in possession an alert piece of defending Will he play it in? And the pass could do damage. Now the attack fizzled out. 
van den Bomen. Can he put it away? Oh, he's missed the chance to open the scoring. Well, that would have been a great start to the game, but that's a bad miss. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent, so what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders. Oh, Stuart, an opportunity. Oh, a goal. There it is. And the crowd stunned into silence. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. And options in the centre. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Jordan Ferry. He has teammates around him. Able to skip past his man. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Delivering it. Oh, a tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Leroy. Jordan Ferry. An alert intervention. Van den Bowman. Ado Onaiwu. Branco van den Bowman. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Leo Leroy. Steffi Mabedidi. Oh, a vital interception. Promising looking ball. So back underway, one goal apiece here. They could nudge in front, and the keeper showing tremendous command. Playing it in, and the danger still on. Jordan Ferry, well read to ease the pressure. get at the opposition well it came to nothing in the end a wonderful intervention chance to finish now the managers will now deliver their half time So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. And teammates around him. Could go ahead. Closing down well. It's a perfect challenge. Good technique displayed. Oh, that's a fine save. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Defenders need to cover. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Takes the shot. And he's 
made it a brace for himself. The defender is just unable to stay with him, and he's having a field day. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2 1. Excellent defending. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Branko van der Bommel. Creative look about this. Now possibilities in the centre. Just not looking confident in possession. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. And he read it well defensively. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Can he put it in? And the keeper stretching to deny him. But he's gone short with it. Good effort here! And narrowly off target here. Well, it's still all to play for, but that was a good effort, wasn't it? Jordan Ferry. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. Mavididi. And he's made headway. Oh, it's off the post. Well, no damage done. Well, it was certainly a chance to get back into the game. And you have to say they're a bit unfortunate. But they do need oh, to... Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Short corner favoured. And he takes on the shot. Making sure it didn't get past him. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Still pressing for a goal here. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. A long way out. Oh, my goodness! What an outrageous hit! I can't believe he took it on from there, and neither can the goalkeeper. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Branko van den Bormen. And a bad pass it was. Van den Bormen. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. And a chance to whip it in here. Can he put it away? Victory more or less guaranteed now. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about...
Hello, everyone. Well, here's something we say every day of the week, don't we? It's a beautiful day for football in Manchester at the Etihad Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City up against Leeds United. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball. Hold on! And that would have been quite the early boost for them. Well, it may be early in the game, Derek, but that chance has to be taken. It's a poor finish. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Kyle Walker plays with João Cancelo in the fullback positions. And it's two strikers up front who'll look to provide the goal scoring threat. And they did have the ball, but not anymore. And the emphasis is on creativity. Simple save, really. Wonderful challenge, and a throw-in coming up. This looks threatening. And it goes! Well, the pressure has been mounting, and now they have the lead! So the ball rolling again, with the score line standing at 1-0. Not a great pass. Can he take advantage? In it goes! Two goals in rapid-fire fashion and looking very comfortable here. 2-0 now and back on the way. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. Big chance! It's still alive and a goal! Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. Well, underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. It leads an accurate cross. Nicely timed tackle. Couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw in to come. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Oh, superb skill. It should be. Oh, good save. And a touch off the defender, last of all. So a corner. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, the keeper can breathe a big sigh of relief. Well, he can. That was so unlucky. How close was that? Well, had that gone in... Oh, wait a minute, Stuart. Look what's happening. Well, there it is. Real resilience for you, having been two goals down. Well, back underway here, and they've split the four goals between them so far. A really sumptuous ball, and the keeper's in trouble. Well, it certainly was a bold attempt. Good to see him try his luck with the chip. Well, it's a great attempt. Opts to lift it over the keeper. Just gets a little bit too much on it. Knight. Holland. And he stopped it. And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. And a chance to restore their advantage. A goal! Accurate from the spot. And the play once again. Manchester City with the advantage. Brendan Aronson. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Gives it a go. Now the keeper grabs it. There will be one minute added on at the end. Hold on! There's still danger here. Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. And so the first... A 
Away they go again. Second half is underway here. That's a good looking ball in behind. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. And City get the throw in. Rodrigo. Edison was always likely to catch that one. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Yeah, he's done okay in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. But unfortunately, that can't be said about the rest of the team, who need to improve if they're going to turn this around. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Well, I must say, it did look so promising, but the flag is raised. Offside the verdict, Stuart. Well, he's just too eager there. It's the right run, but he's made it too early. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Well, that's a well-timed pass. Nicely saved. Played over. Immediate priority to clear the danger. Really getting stuck in. Firing it towards goal. Body on the line. Promising sequence. Is it going to be? Player in the way again. And a very good challenge. Wilfried Nyonto. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Riyad Mahrez. Well, Manchester City unable to retain possession. Rodrigo. Oh, maybe the equaliser. And begging to be put away. Decent shots, but the post getting in the way. Goal kick it is. Manuel Akanji, De Bruyne, Alvarez. Well, great read there to intercept. Still not clear. Well, nothing comes of it. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Superb block. Riyad Mahrez. Spot on with that tackle. Firing it in. It looked as though it had a chance of going in for the equaliser. It was close, it was a decent effort, just need to keep plugging away now and surely the goal will come. Kevin De Bruyne. And that puts them in position. Oh, could be a chance. And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. So the current scoreline, 4-2. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Oh, what a goal! A tremendous strike! And there goes the final whistle. A real sense of feel-good for... Talk to you.
of different shades. Chelsea again. A warm welcome. Blue is the colour. Football is the game, as the old song used to go. We're here at Stamford Bridge tonight in West London. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Chelsea facing... Well, the goalkeeper doing what he's paid to do. A Chelsea corner. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Kepa stands between the posts. Thiago Silva plays alongside Kalidou Koulibaly in central defence. Jorginho plays alongside Denis Zakaria in the centre of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Erling Haaland! Oh, he squandered the chance and he knows it. Well, it wouldn't have counted anyway. He was offside, but nonetheless, that was a poor attempt. Obama Yang. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Knight. Joao Felix. And a strong tackle. Bernardo Silva. using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Significant acreage for City to run into. And a very good challenge. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. On to James. And it's a quality pass. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Knight. Oh, he's gone for goal. Oh, he's only gone and found the net. What purity of hit. Caught it absolutely perfectly. So, underway again here. One nil the score. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. Ziyech and an astute piece of defending intelligent threaded pass here and he could cash in and another one two quick goals will it turn out to be the two punch knockout so the ball rolling again at 2-0 Space to cross it. Felix. Defensive excellence there. Bernardo Silva. Now can they counter clinically? All hands on deck. And just like that, the counter attack comes to an end. Room to maneuver on the wing. Could reduce the deficit. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. So almost at the end of the first 45, and Chelsea a long way from their best. Stuart. Oh, they've... can he finish it here, Derek? And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. So the action continues, and City really cantering to victory here. Kukureya, Zakaria, and that's an important intervention. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford. So back in business with City very much the dominant side. Can they repeat that in the second 45? Opportunity in the wide area. A 
lopsided contest. 4 0. This could pose problems for the defenders. The crossbar got in the way. And it came to nothing in the end. Well, how did that not go in? It was a great effort, you have to say. Well, they have to have that sense of self-belief. It could happen for them. Alvarez. Might really be able to trouble them here. In possession, but pressure to cope with. A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Oh my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Kukureya. On to Jorginho. Felix. And here's Ziyech. And return to Joao Felix. Zakaria. And no way through. Alvarez. On to Holland. Mares. It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, it's an out and out pasting. 6 0. And that was a very fine read. He has teammates around him. Oh, managing to beat him. And just over the bar, really good effort. Well, those stats tell the story. City have been really good today. Their attacking play has been a joy to watch here. And they're raiding again here. Attack after attack. James. On to Jorginho. Joao Felix. Sterling. Felix. Well, from that position, he really should be doing more to work the goalkeeper. Kevin De Bruyne. The inside route looks promising. Well, just narrowly over the crossbar. Good hit, though. Jorginho. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Poor pass. Showing a lot of guile there. But Stapp defending when it mattered. Can he put it away? And able to get a body in the way. Kevin De Bruyne, not to be advised giving the ball away there. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, he keeps going. And Sterling has it. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Well, there's the final whistle, and Manchester City have come out on top in this game.
can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And here's the team for Everton. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. Connor Cody plays alongside James Tarkovsky in central defence. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Must take the lead here. McNeil. Vitali Mikolenko. Kavat Lewin. Well, can they open up the defence here? Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. Mope. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent. Hang so on, Derek, it's a chance here. Just can't get it past him. Well, a piece of quick thinking by the keeper. Well, that's great goalkeeping. He read it so well, didn't he? Excellent ball over the top. Well, it could be on for him here. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. Not a great pass. Now, potential danger. Well, nothing comes of it in the end because the flag has gone up, Stuart. Well, he knew where the space was, but he's just been too eager, and that's why he's offside. Calvert Lewin. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Alvarez. Good looking ball. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Tarkovsky. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. This looks threatening. And a goal! Now they've broken through. 1-0. So Everton get the ball moving again. Can they find a response here? Mope. Well read to put an end to that attack. Holland. An effective cross. And a fantastic diving save. Put in by De Bruyne, fractionally over the top. We're really closing him down here. Gordon, just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. A really top-notch piece of defending. Well, City haven't bossed the possession, as you can see. But when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Another stoppage time situation. One minute here. A City corner it is. And he struck the post. And so there we have it. Second half underway with City looking to build upon a positive first half performance. Everton moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? 
Onana. Mope. Could be. Oh, he's blocked it. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Oh, a lovely ball. Holland. And a really powerful effort, but just over the top. Mikolenko. Neil Mope. Vitali Mikolenko. Moving the ball nicely. Trying to carve out the equaliser. Foul there. Free kick awarded. He plays it short. Covert Lewin. Nicely timed tackle. Now let's see if something comes of this. Happy to take on the shot. And now the goal the City fans wanted to see. It's hard to see them throwing this away. So underway again. And a 2-0 advantage here. Well, they have the ball once more. So a half an hour remaining. Amadou Onana. Return to Calvert-Lewin. Could pull one back here. What an important piece of defending. Alvarez. And he takes it away. De Bruyne. Can he put it in? Oh, it's off the post. Given away by City. Well, I have to say, I thought that looked to be going in. It was such a good effort. Yes, a really up and flow to the game. End-to-end -end stuff. Vitali Mikolenko. An important interception. Oh, great piece of individual skill. McNeil. This might be ideal for the counter. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. And he's broken free. Well, the action underway again. So comfortable for City, it's turning into a trouncing. Calvert Lewin. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Excellent ball over the top. And in with a real chance. And a goal to seal the hat trick. A master class in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Idrissa Gay, well, far from the ideal pass. Excellent use of advantage from the referee in City's favour. Oh, a perfectly timed pass, and just has to remain calm. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. And a routine catch for the Brazilian. Oh my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. The referee has decided there will be just one minute. So there goes the final whistle. And this hasn't gone at all to plan.
Manchester City versus Leicester City. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Failure to keep the ball by Leicester. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat. Superbly read and executed. Well, here's how Leicester City will line up. Harvey Barnes plays with Ayose Perez out wide. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Promising attack, this. Superb block. Erling Haaland! Well, good technique in terms of how he struck it. And he read it well, intercepting it. Ianacho. Harvey Barnes. Great pressure to win the ball back. And blocked for now. Alvarez Daka the Foxes moving the ball forward what can they do from here well didn't go as a plan in the end Daka and showing fine vision Iannaccio, tremendously strong in the tackle. Well, Leicester have certainly dominated possession over the last 15 minutes. They're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat. You feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination. Tielemans. Now Iannaccio. Daka. Just the challenge that was required. Alvarez. Could really get at the opposition but nothing comes of it good defending it was and he was being pressed but did his job Ruben Dias Holland Mares Now to play for a Manchester City throw-in. De Bruyne must take the lead here. Able to get his body in the way. Well, a good tackle. Alvarez. De Bruyne now. Teammates available. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Ianacho has it. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. So back in business. Leicester with the lead. But this game far from being done and dusted. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Sustained pressure, and they have the ball now. And a creative look about this. And he 
read it well defensively. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, after a slow start when he was tightly marked, he got better and better as the first... Everson and goal made it look easy. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, not cleared away completely. And a goal kick it'll be. Too much height on the shot. Alvarez. And an astute piece of defending. Daka on the offensive. Harvey Barnes. Can he take advantage? Emerson, wonderful goalkeeping. Iannaccio, Harvey Barnes, timely intervention. Knight, and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Palmer with it. Just 20 minutes remaining now. He's given us away. Dewsbury Hall. Alvarez. Well, if these City players aren't inspired now... They oh, it's developing nicely for them here. Well, nearing the end, it's not happening for City at the moment in terms of the scoreline. Can they change that? Well, it's been tight, but they've lacked a cutting edge. They've done well at the back and in midfield, but the final pass, the short or cross, have lacked that bit of quality. Can they find that missing link in these final few minutes? Iannaccio. Iannaccio. Just cutting off the supply. Just listen to this crowd. They want a bit more. They know there's still plenty of time to find an equaliser. Surely they get another chance. Maybe two. This could square the game. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. And we've entered the final five minutes. Iannaccio. Leicester now in a potentially dangerous position. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. So the referee brings this match to an end and it goes down as a victim.
Stamford Bridge. Marvellous piece of skill. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Kepa stands between the posts. Thiago Silva plays alongside Kalidou Koulibaly in central defence. Hakim Ziyech plays with Raheem Sterling out wide. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And the lineup for Leicester City. Yuri Tiedemans plays alongside Wilfred Ndidi in the engine room. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat. Sterling. Out of play for what will be a Chelsea throw. Jorginho. And now Sterling. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. And the keeper more than equal to the task. And played short. Sterling. Koulibaly. Wonderful chance. Nicely saved. And the short option preferred. It is now with Jorginho. Oh, big opportunity. There it is. The opening goal of this match, and what a start they've made. So the action underway again, and certainly the onus is on Leicester to come up with a reply here. Daka. Joao Felix and Leicester regaining possession free kick to Chelsea and with the goalkeeper and he read it well intercepting it rather than a free kick it's advantage Chelsea Sterling Chelsea pushing to add to their lead. It'll be a corner. Elects to go short. It is now with Jorginho. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. Tielemans. Here's Tielemans. Madison with it. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Jorginho. There to win it back. What can Chelsea do from this position? Precise ball movement. Chance to finish. And a goal! They're going to take some stopping now. Two in front here. So back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. And Sterling has it. And on to Felix. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Well, he's got to be disappointed with that pass. Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Yes, it's so true. For once, they find themselves in defensive mode. Given away by Chelsea. 
There will be one minute added on at the end. Madison. Now with Tielemans. Can he finish? Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. And so the first half draws to a close. Showing patience as well. Well, away they go again, and it was an eye-catching display by Chelsea in the first half of this match. Well, he really read that brilliantly. And the counter looks on here, options available. Real chance. Jorginho and Sterling has it well that's how to keep the opposition at bay Iheanacho now, do they mean business on this occasion well nothing comes of it it looked promising Tielemans Daka. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. Nicely timed tackle. Kukureya. On to Jorginho. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. 30 minutes to go then. But a crucial intervention inside the box. But it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Leonacho. Room to roam for Chelsea on the wing. No possibilities inside the box. Under pressure. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. James Madison. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. And attempting the through ball. Not going to get away with that because it's offside here and he shouldn't be offside there he's gone too early and that's a waste of a great opportunity Daka just the challenge that was required excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward long way out this a oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping They take it short. Bad pass. Ten minutes to go then. Castagna. Now indeedy. James Madison. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Iheanacho. Now, who can he play it to? Could pull one back here. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Joao Felix. And that was a very fine read. And we will have just one additional minute. Gives it a go. They've got themselves back into it. A lifeline. And that is full time. Chelsea have prevailed. Three points. Showing patience.
As always, is Stuart Robson. Stuart, what are you expecting? Well, I'm expecting a tough game for Spurs because this derby is much bigger for West Ham than it is for Tottenham. For them, a victory over Spurs is always one to savour. And a goal to open the scoring. A very bright start to this one. So West Ham get us moving again, and a swift response required after the setback. Paqueta, poor pass. Romero. Possession lost by West Ham. And Yuma. Lucas Mora. And still looking for space. And a very good challenge. It's a corner. And the danger's still on. And I think the threat has been averted. Paqueta. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Oh, a splendid skill. But a crucial intervention inside the box. Teammates available. And Yuma on the ball, Richarlison. He takes aim and caught by the keeper. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Richarlison, and it's gone in just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Saar. Really getting stuck in. Well, he needed to read it to get there, and did. Lucas Moura. He shot this on. Terrific block. Well, we're almost at the halfway stage and they're not making home advantage work for them one little bit here. Stuart, your assessment? Well, they can certainly play better than this. It's been a disappointing first half display from them. But if they can just play with more urgency and... Really good diving save. Well, this has to be their way back into the game. The crowd are certainly playing their part. Not really the ideal clearance. Reading it well. Well, no real accuracy, and easy for the keeper. Well, the stoppage time situation, one minute here. And that brings to an end the first half here. Away they go again, into the second half. It was spellbinding stuff from Spurs in the first 45.
Can he find the right pass? Terrific block. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Going for the dink. And that's a very good parry. We're really closing him down here. Richarlison. Son. Flag up, tight offside. Just the challenge that was required. And the referee blows for a foul. And they've given him too much space. The cross is on. Oh, great defending. They're making high pressing work for them here. In it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, two one it is here. Now, options are plenty. Lanzini, nicely timed tackle. Well, as the stats show us, Spurs haven't enjoyed that much of the ball, but their counter-attacking has been really good. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. And a goal it is for Tottenham Hotspur. Well, of course, for victory here. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. High quality defending. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. 20 minutes to go. Antonio. A real opening now. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. So back underway. Can West Ham find another one? Good tackle. Well, nearing full time, and here's the question. Are they going to come up just that little bit short? Stuart, your thoughts? Well, what a finale this will be. They've had so many chances throughout the game, but they just need to find a composed finish in the dying moments. They've certainly deserved something from this game, but time is running out. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Paqueta. How can they find a late leveller? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Given away by Tottenham. Five minutes left. Well, it hasn't been a great performance, but the fans have been brilliant. Just listen to the noise. Can the players respond and find this equaliser? This could level it. Defensive excellence there. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Lanzini. Now with Antonio. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. And there goes the final whistle. The overalls...
excitement tonight here at the Theater of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Manchester United up against West Ham United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And a good-looking ball. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. The lineup for Manchester oh, look United. Look at Derek here. Oh, a goal! Oh! Action underway once more. Let's see if United have the wherewithal to square the game. Antonio. Nicely timed tackle. And fed forwards. Oh, he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal. Keeper has it now. Error from the keeper. Will they seize on it? Antonio 
That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Martial. Bruno Fernandes has it. De Horst. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Antonio. going to end up being productive for them well disappointing end to the move good looking sequence Antonio and quite simply a wonderful chance was squandered could play it in Horst. Well, he tried in vain to get himself back on side. Well, he needs to show greater awareness there and hold on to the ball a fraction longer. Skamaka. How can he take them on and beat them? Well, he had the measure of it, the goalkeeper. And over it comes. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. Growing pressure here, and another corner. Still not clear. And Varane foiling them. Martial outthought by his opponent. Giving it a try. And good work to deny the chance. Can someone get on the end of this? Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And a crucial intervention inside the box. Antonio. Now with Ben Rahma. Lanzini. Determined defending. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Opportunity in the wide area. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. And there goes the whistle. That closes... So back underway with United looking to plot a route back into this game. An awful lot of green space to run into. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? So a level contest. 1-1. to blast that one past the keeper but his radar was a bit off and he read it well plenty of running room in the wide position well the goalkeeper doing what he's paid to do an opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. The high press was very much on. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. We'll just take a look at the stats. They've certainly been created opportunities, but they just haven't been clinical enough in front of goal. Some of their finishing has been really poor. That has to improve at some point in this game. First things first, they need possession of the ball. And just slightly offside.
Jared Bowen. Anthony Martial. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Can he put them ahead? Might still be able to do a bit of damage. In it goes! But it will not stand. Offside, Stewart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. Ericsson. More than decent, this, from United. It's got to be! And it's two for him today! A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Paqueta. Nicely timed tackle. Antonio. Chances on. And the keeper nowhere to be found, not that he's complaining. So back underway, the game having been squared at 2-2. Anthony Martial. And an astute piece of defending. Lanzini. And a good-looking ball. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Has eyes for goal! Well, it wasn't quite as dangerous as I thought it might be. Well, that would probably have been the winner. It's so unlucky. Is there going to be a dramatic finish here? Let's hope so. Well, that's a super ball over the top. And he clears it out of harm's way. Could play it in. A long way out. Decent effort there. Well, he has such good technique. He really did hit that well. He certainly came close there. Oh, he's given the ball away. Ericsson. It's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Ericsson. Bruno Fernandes has it. And there's the whistle, all even at the end of 90 minutes. Seasons come and go like thoughts of you Like a wave returns to the sea into the blue They change but in a cycle that I can't lose Each painful but delightful to live through you came into my life just like another season Not for long, just a time, just like another season Maybe this time next year you'll reappear for no reason But I'll cherish every day until you come my way this season Just like 
Tremendous match, and it's West Ham United with a kickoff. Can he find the net? And the keeper getting across to stop it. Can someone get on the end of this? And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, Newcastle United get the ball moving again. Can they come up with a response now? Opportunity here. There it is. A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. Long stuff. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Skipping away. Now a decent position. Oh, it's mischievous. Oh, a superb chip. Spellbinding. So the ball rolling again. And West Ham really starting to accelerate away. Willock. Longstaff. Plenty of support here. But quick thinking defensively. Gianluca Scamacca in possession Bowen went in strongly decisively Bruno Guimaraes Almiron they couldn't maintain possession opportunity Oh, did so well to deny him. Yet another tremendous save to add to the list. Skamaka. Disappointing pass. Well, there you have it. West Ham have had so much of the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. And that was a very fine read. Joao Linton. A really 
sumptuous ball. Well, it might still work out for them. And I think the threat has been averted. Well, the keeper deserves a lot of credit. That was a fine save, wasn't it? Space for the Magpies in the wide position. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Well, the short corner routine. Long staff. Determined block. Joao Linton. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. So back underway. 3-1 the score. Downs. Surely! Well, he opted for power from close range. He might be regretting that now. Long stuff. On to Almiron. Trippier now. Well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Well, the first half story has been written. So back underway, and there can be no playing it down. There was a big gulf between the sides in the first half. Will we see a response from the Magpies in the second? And they could get one back here. Oh, another one for them! And with plenty of time still remaining, this game is very much back on! Underway again. And we're being treated to plenty of goals. 3-2 at the moment. Beautifully weighted ball. But how well he did to react in that manner. A good and fair challenge. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. Wilson and a very good challenge Jared Bowen Sven Botman Wilson with it Joao Linton on to Wilson. Just made sure nothing came of that. Could be! Oh, can you believe this? Back from the brink and wild celebrations on the touchline. Not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team. Callum Wilson. This might be ideal for the counter. Almiron, determined defending. Well, this is such a good watch. Both teams have played their part in a great game with plenty of good forward play. I'm sure we'll see more goals before the end. He's got the right idea with that pass. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Oh, a lovely ball. Aaron Cresswell. Well, can do better in terms of the pass. Moving into the advanced position. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Long stuff. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Options in the centre. Well, able to close down the shot. 
If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. And the keeper's hand does the trick. Disappointing pass. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, they haven't been at their best, but these Newcastle fans have been brilliant. Just listen to the noise. Can the players respond and find this equaliser? It's a perfect challenge. Joe Willock are getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Almiron. Joao Linton. But a crucial intervention inside the box. And the referee blows the whistle. That will be all for this game.